Hi guys, it's Bags of President Ross. Today we have an updated election map according to realclearpolling.com. Who do you guys want to win? Let us know in the comments. Also, like, share, and sub. Hello everyone, it's your President Ross, the one and the only. Today we are going to fill in Washington with 12 electoral votes is blue for Kamala Harris. Oregon with 8 electoral votes is currently blue for Kamala Harris. California with 54 electoral votes is blue for Kamala Harris. Alaska with 3 electoral votes is having a red wave. It is red for Donald J. Trump. Hawaii with 4 electoral votes is blue for Kamala Harris. There has been some shift, but it's, it's still a deep blue. Now we're going up to Montana with 4 electoral votes is red. For Donald J. Trump. This puts Donald J. Trump at 7 electoral votes so far. And Kamala Harris at 78. With just these few states. Idaho with 4 electoral votes is red for Donald J. Trump. Wyoming with 3 electoral votes is red for Donald J. Trump. Nevada. We have uh, the information from realclearpolling.com has Harris at a 1.2 lead, so Nevada with six electoral votes is blue for Kamala Harris. Republicans take over in Utah with six electoral votes. They are red for Donald J. Trump in Utah. Arizona, according to realclearpolling.com, Trump has a two-point lead over Harris. It is currently red once again with 11 electoral votes for Donald J. Trump. Colorado with 10 electoral votes is blue for Kamala Harris. New Mexico with 5 electoral votes is blue for Kamala Harris. North Dakota with 3 electoral votes is red for Donald J. Trump. South Dakota with 3 electoral votes is red for Donald J. Trump. Nebraska with 4 electoral votes in 2 districts. The state is red for Donald J. Trump. The first district is red for Donald J. Trump, and the tiniest district is blue for Kamala Harris. Not much has changed there here recently. Kansas, with six electoral votes, is red for Donald J. Trump. Oklahoma, with seven electoral votes, is red for Donald J. Trump. Texas, with 40 electoral votes, is red for Donald J. Trump. If you're from Texas, give us a shout out in the comments. Represent. Minnesota, with 10 electoral votes, is blue for Tampon Timmy. Iowa, with 6 electoral votes, is red for Donald J. Trump. Missouri, with 10 electoral votes, is red for Donald J. Trump. Arkansas, with 6 electoral votes, is red for Donald J. Trump. Louisiana, with 8 electoral votes, is red for Donald J. Trump. With this half of the map currently filled in, we have Democrats Kamala Harris at 110 electoral votes. And Republican Donald J. Trump with 122 electoral votes. Let's get to the last half coming up. Wisconsin, according to RealClearPolling.com, has a one-point lead. It is blue for Kamala Harris. Illinois, with 19 electoral votes, is blue for Kamala Harris. Michigan, on the top right, with 15 electoral votes. According to Real Clear Polling, she is winning by 1.7 points. It makes no sense, but... Blue for Kamala Harris. Now we have the red wave coming in hot. Indiana with 11 electoral votes is red for Donald J. Trump. Ohio with 17 electoral votes is red for Donald J. Trump. West Virginia with 4 electoral votes is red for Donald J. Trump. Kentucky with 8 electoral votes is red for Donald J. Trump. Tennessee with 11 electoral votes is red for Donald J. Trump. Mississippi with 6 electoral votes is red for Donald J. Trump. Alabama, with nine electoral votes, and the cousin lover state of them all, is red for Donald J. Trump. Shocker. Florida, with 30 electoral votes, is red for Donald J. Trump. Georgia, according to RealClearPolling.com, Trump has a 1.5 lead in Georgia. It is currently red for Donald J. Trump with 16 electoral votes. South Carolina, with nine electoral votes, is red for Donald J. Trump. North Carolina, according to RealClearPolling.com, Trump has a 1.4 lead now. It is 
Red for Donald J. Trump in North Carolina. Virginia with 13 electoral votes is blue for Kamala Harris. Now, Pennsylvania. Harris has a 0.4% lead, or point lead, in Pennsylvania. We're going to make it blue for Kamala Harris. And we also have Maine, which is more blue today than it was the other day for Kamala Harris. And the rest of the states, according to RealClearPolling.com, are blue for Kamala Harris, including New York, Vermont, Connecticut, New Jersey, Delaware, Rhode Island, the District of Washington, D.C., or D.C., sorry, not Washington. Yes, this puts Kamala Harris at 272 electoral votes and Republican Donald J. Trump at 259. How does this make you feel, everyone? Let us know in the comments below. Who do you want to win, baby? Donald Trump. Why? Make America great. And that's a good enough reason. Join us next time on Bags and President Ross's Electoral Map Showdown for 2024 presidential election. We'll see you in the next one.